We're here behind the scenes of Narco Sub with actor Blaine Ochoa. Blaine, tell us about your acting experience. <laughs> So I've been a professional actor now for about two years. I'm, I'm now signed with Paige Parks Agency here in Texas, and I've only been doing commercial work. I've been in quite a few commercials uh, throughout Texas, but this is my first film to be a part of, so very excited and honored to be a part of the cast. How did you come to be involved in Narco Sub? So I knew Sean, who's a director. I met him through a mutual friend, and then I met Derek, the producer, at a pre-premiere party for the film, and um, you know, we talked about it, and uh, you know, it was a mutual agreement to have me a part of it, so I'm very happy. What character do you play? I play Agent Kelly. She's an undercover CIA agent. Um, it's really fun for me to play her part, um, you know, just kind of get more in touch with my tough girl side, but also keep a certain sensual you know, aspect about my character to me, too. Tell us some more about her. <laughs> so she's undercover the whole time. She has, she's very um, tough, you know, down to business. She, she's a part of the opening scenes, and so that was really neat for me to get to play, and it kind of leads into the rest of the film, or it sets the tone for the rest of the film. Um, a lot of action parts, even in my, my scenes, too. Um, I get knocked out, and then I have to, by the drug cartel guys, and I have to save myself when I come back, you know, come back to my senses. I have to save myself, and then um, I end up killing the guy who was trying to kill me, and then I go in to save the girls and try to complete my mission. What was the most challenging part of playing her? I think doing, so in one part, there is a sensual scene that I have to do in order to save myself um, from the cartel. And so I think, you know, doing that on camera um, was challenging, you know, because I've never done that, you know, on screen. Um, and then also speaking Spanish. So my character speaks Spanish and English throughout, throughout the film. And so just having to switch back, you know, and really learn my lines in Spanish and executing those, I think, was the biggest challenge. But it, in the end, it really, it grew me as an actress. So I'm, I'm happy that we were able to do that. What did you do to get in character? I did a lot of just meditation, um, preparing, practicing my lines over and over, and, you know, eating healthy and working out so I could look the best that I could for my role as well. What's your favorite scene in the film? I think the fire scene, the fire scene that um, was, I think, my favorite. You know, that was the central part I had to do, but it was a very powerful moment for my character. Um, you know, she uses her, you know, her brain, you know, uses her mind and what's, what's going to work out best to save her life and complete her mission. And so, you know, she seduces the guy and then ends up killing him um, in the end and um, having to go back and set it, try to save the girls. How would you describe this story and what does it mean to you? I think it's a powerful message. You know, it's bringing to light, um, you know, the negative impact and the negative things that are happening. Uh, kidnapping, uh, sex trafficking, drugs. Those are huge issues, you know, I think that everyone, you know, needs to um, try to combat. You know, it's a horrible and I think that's what the movie is doing. It's bringing to light um, those issues and I, hopefully it will inspire others to do their part. And, you know, if they see something happening like that, that's horrible, um, you know, to say something and try to help. And where can fans find you? You can find me on Instagram at Blaine Janelle or Facebook at Blaine Ochoa. Perfect. Will you be attending any film festivals? I do plan on doing it, yes. I plan to go to the Austin Film Festival and hopefully international film festivals to come.